Hey Libra, this is Yasha, also known as F9, and I am back with another message for you guys. This message is for April 2020. Um, pretty much the energies that we will be dealing with. Ooh, they're just flying out for us today. Okay, that's a lot. <laughs> but um, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are staying safe. I hope you guys are staying your asses in the house, okay? I hope your family members aren't doing the most, getting on your nerves and shit, okay? If you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm an intuitive reader, um, psychic healer, whatever y'all want to call it. That's what I do. Um, I curse, so if y'all don't like that, y'all should head out. Um, and before I get into it, um, if you feel like this reading resonates with your situation greatly, please hit that like button. Um, the more people that see this video, the better. If you feel like you're digging my vibe, give me a, a subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell so you guys can always stay up to date when I post new stuff. I try to post as much as I can. I'm trying to venture out right now to other outlets other than YouTube, okay? Um, so yeah, if you guys find that you guys want like a personal reading, I am currently doing different tiers of readings i have ten dollar readings 25 dollar readings 44 dollar readings food dollar readings so definitely hit me up you can find my email in the description box below along with my whatsapp um information i currently accept paypal cash app and venmo and i have been doing really good with getting my readings out to my clients within like 48 hours so um if you give me your email i send you a link a video link to your email address and you will have that link aka your reading forever so that's that on that um everything can be found in the description box below though so i'm gonna get into it my readings aren't gonna it's gonna start being a little bit more short because i don't want to wear myself out too thin okay but i did pull out some crystals for you guys so for the april vibe i have amethyst carnelian celestite and citrine i'll put these bitches right here i want to get some new crystals too eventually when i can take my ass outside for real i'm gonna set it up like that make it like shit i don't know <laughs> i should have organized this before but whatever there you are okay so we're going to get into it. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading. Um, usually when I have a reading, it resonates with every soul. So that's pretty dope. But um, this applies to whatever Libra is in your chart, whatever house it's in. Whatever. I get different energies. Pick up what you want to pick up that resonates. Leave what don't. Don't make everything fit your, your, your storyline. Don't do that shit. You're going to like give yourself a headache. Okay overall energies you guys are on a spiritual path we're on a spiritual path i have the page of pentacles right here you guys are, are i'm hearing in search of something that is tangible in search of something greater greater bigger than life you guys are looking for meaning observation you guys might have been rolling with wolves okay in the wild adventurous um living beyond your means you know what i'm saying like being a go-getter but this didn't come without trouble you guys have been guided to go on this spiritual journey because there has been a catalyst a, an eruption a shake-up in your family structure okay so if you guys have like a family of your own i'm hearing that there may be some turmoil in your family I'm getting another message that this may not even be us. Perhaps you're dealing with someone who's on a spiritual journey at the moment and trying to find meaning in their life. And maybe they're the ones that fucked up the family dynamic. We have the four of wands here in reverse. Um, this may have been caused with a, a weak moment. I have strength in reverse. So something in regards to... A blockage in the root chakra and the sacral chakra therefore this person may have been i'm hearing promiscuous may have been a hoe out there may have stepped out on the family 
may have turned their back on the family. I don't have the Ten of Swords here yet, so I can't say it's a betrayal, but something occurred or something may occur in the month of April that is going to propel either you or this person to going on a spiritual journey. A spiritual journey I'm hearing they should have been on a long fucking time ago, okay? Someone is searching for, searching for meaning in life. Someone is searching for God is what I'm hearing. Um, I'm hearing for some of you guys, this person, either you or this specific individual could have fucked their money up. Um, could have had a weak moment that maybe took a mad hit crazy hit on your bank account your savings i'm hearing for some of you guys i'm also seeing white flowers so white flowers may be some sort of significance for you guys or i'm hearing maybe you guys should go out and buy some white flowers for yourself um maybe it'll heal you purify you etc so chakras that look like they need to be worked on of course is your root chakra sacral chakra I heard somebody may have someone that's jealous of them, um, but there may be also a need to pray to your angels, your spirit guides. Um, I'm hearing that for someone because maybe there is a pack of wolves I'm seeing here that may be out to get you and stop you from your journey, but definitely get um, white flowers for purity to heal and to bring in light and love into your home okay and i'm hearing for somebody specific prosperity and abundance when it comes to money but otherwise i'm hearing jealousy so be on the lookout for like someone that may be a wolf in sheep's clothing this person could actually be the one that tries to ruin your family and get you when you are at your weakest point or this may have occurred already so be on your p's and q's there may be a wolf in sheep clothing okay and if you're dealing with a person a lover or a husband, a wife, a boyfriend, a girlfriend, whomever, um, a family member even, they could be the sheep and wolf's clothing as well. And they could also be in a lower vibration um, and be taking at a moment of weakness. But this is only occurring due to the point that they are vulnerable, their vessels are vulnerable, okay? The demons have caught them at a low point in their life so their bodies are more capable of being jumped into i'm hearing it goes way beyond a spiritual level. this is a very spiritual reading i'm getting okay but um signs involved fire signs a leo definitely and his lower vibration or her lower vibration okay aries sagittarius earth signs taurus virgo or a capricorn Definitely sleep with amethyst under your pillow at night to avoid spiritual attacks. Ground yourself with carnelian or citrine um, to raise your vibration and to raise your confidence. Um, the amethyst will help you get more in tune with your intuition and your third eye in cases of discernment. And the celestite will help you contact angels and ground you and keep you at peace and tranquility and, and guide you into more so stepping into your adventure. I'm hearing to get onto the road you need to get onto to get onto your spiritual journey. So, um, I think I'm going to leave it there, Libra. Again, if you guys want to look more into your specific situation, definitely hit me up for a personal reading. All readings are released within 24 to 48 hours. I accept PayPal, Cash App, Venmo. Everything will be in the description box below if you're interested. Okay? Um, I love you guys. Thanks for so much for tuning in. Please hit the like button. Share this video to other Libras that may appreciate it. And definitely feel free to comment below. Also, let me know how this resonated with you guys. Alright? And subscribe if you haven't done so. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.